Hey everyone, this is Mr. Dunkel. I want to show you quickly how to use Microsoft Word and the templates it has to create a memo. So I've opened up Microsoft Word, and before I select a type of document, you'll notice I have a lot of templates available. If I go up here to the search box at the top, I can simply type in the word memo and hit enter, and it's going to search thousands of templates, and you'll see that it's find several or has found several memos that I can use. And you could really use pretty much any of these up here. I'm going to choose this one here that says Inner Office Memo. And when you choose it, just click the Create button. And in just a moment, it will load it here. And so this we can use this template. You notice it has the To, the From, the CC for Carbon Copy, the Date, and the RE for Regarding. And so your instructions tell you kind of what to put in here. In my case, it already knows my name's Chris. So this template actually put me in, uh, you know, from Chris you'd want to put your actual name. Uh, if you'd like, you can come up here to company name and we can just call this MJHS. And then down here at the bottom is where you're going to type the information you need to type about your Marvel Matters topic. So for the assignment, you're simply just going to open up a template for a memo, complete the to from CC date and regarding. And again, you can refer to the instructions. And then for this bottom part, you're going to type in a business format, simply meaning that you need to use proper grammar and proper language. Uh, you're going to type in respectful language, I should say as well. Uh, you're going to simply type, what is your Marvel Matters topic? Why did you choose that topic? How do you plan to do your topic? Like, what are you going to be doing for it? And then also, how do you plan to share it at you know, with others. And so this is all stuff that we've talked about before. So it should be easy for you to do. You're just simply putting it in a memo format. Once you're done, you're going to save it and, uh, you know, obviously save it somewhere you can get to and then go into the turn in assignments here link on my Blackboard page and submit it. So that's all there is to it. If you have any questions, as always, don't hesitate to ask. Thank you.